Hey everyone, Dr. Karan here. If you have type 2 diabetes and you may wonder how often you should check your sugar and what does sliding the scale insulin mean and how does your pre-meal sugar affect your post-meal sugar. Let's make this simple and clear today. So the answer depends on your treatment plan. If you are on medication only, check once a day or a few times a week at different times. But if you are on long-acting um, insulin like Lantus, Basaglar, or Toshiba, you should check every morning and sometimes at bedtime. But you are on rapid insulin before meals, check before each meal and at bedtime. Remember, the goal isn't to collect numbers, but is to understand patterns, fasting, pre-meal and post-meal trends. What is sliding scale? Sliding scale means your insulin dose slides up and down depending up, uh, on your pre-meal glucose. It's a corrective system. Um, if your sugar is high before eating, you got to take extra rapid acting insulin like Humalog, Novolog to bring it down. Example, pre-meal sugar is less than 150, no extra units. But if between 150 to 200 is really two units, 200 to 201 to 250, four units, 251 to 300, six units, 301 to 350, eight units. Um, but if it's more than that, you should definitely contact your doctor and figure out and change your sliding scale. It's like adjusting the volume, higher sugar, higher dose. So why pre-meal sugar matters? Your pre-meal sugar is a starting point for two hour um, post meal reading. If it's already high, say 180, even a normal meal can push it up to 50. If it's normal, suppose around 100, you're likely to stay under 160 after two hours. So that's why pre-meal reading decides the insulin correction. It prevents the post-meal spike. Connecting the dot, the sliding scale targets two things. The sugar that's already in your blood, which is pre-meal, and the sugar that's about to come from food, which is going to be post-meal. So adjusting insulin before you eat ensures your post-meal sugar stays below 180, helping long-term A1C control. So in conclusion, got to remember this fasting sugar guides your long acting insulin pre-meal sugar guides your sliding scale insulin and two hour sugar tells you how your insulin and meal work together so check it wisely record consistently review regularly and that's the secret to diabetes control